Hey, it's Sean with Sean's DIY and Reviews, and I'm gonna review this Goosebox Slim Case for the Fold 2. Shows you, this is supposed to be the blue. It's kind of like a gray. I don't really know that the color is the right one, but uh, you know, I just got this on Amazon. I like that you can put some cards in here, which isn't bad. And then here, you just pop the phone in this guy right here. And let's take a look over on this side. So yeah, this is definitely raised up, so it should probably protect the lens from sitting flat. And then, this kind of holds on okay. Sort of, right? So I have it upside down. And it's not just opening on its own. Kind of magnetizes on there, which isn't bad. So, yeah, it's definitely like a vinyl kind of feel to it. And you can hear that. And I'd say it's definitely like a plasticky vinyl. But yeah, when this is open, there's gonna have no protection on the front. But if I open the screen, then it kind of sits in there okay, right? And it sits over the edge. And this is actually, no, nah, it doesn't really magnetize on there when it's open. It seems to be just when it's closed. But it holds on okay. So not much else to say about this case. They're calling this blue. I feel like it's kind of a gray. Maybe it's a little bit blue, but um, yeah, it wasn't the color I was thinking it was from the picture. What do you think? Uh, down here, I don't see any protection whatsoever on this bottom in the front and the front of the screen. The back of the screen, you're going to get some protection because you have that little plastic that goes there, but nothing over here, which I guess is probably par for the course with the design because of the fold so you can't have it attached the way this is attached on here you couldn't attach something on there it wouldn't open properly the phone that sits on the stand on the case as a stand here this would just go right into the middle of the fold i've also tried it where i just laid this flat and then folded this down the other way and if i am able to put this into a slot of some sort it'll hold that way too. So there's a couple different ways that the case will hold the phone up and you can use it that way. The only downside I think to this is that the power and uh, turning on the phone is not on this side. So you'd have to reach to the bottom in order to do that. So, but it's at least an interesting feature that you might find works well for you. So I don't know. I don't feel like this is the case that I'm gonna stick with, but it's not the end of the world either. It does provide some level of coverage over the back of the screen of, for the camera. And then it does kind of hold on to the front, which isn't bad. I will say that there's a Samsung one that just covers the back and doesn't cover the front at all. So it may just be that this isn't so bad. It's just what you get with the phone. You know, this style of phone commands this kind of a case so yeah let me know what you think in the comments below and that's my review of this particular case right here